Hello tell teller cellists, welcome to Parkle Bells Canon. I've done a slowed down version. This is in D major. It's it sounds simple, but actually it's one of the hardest pieces to play and make sound good. Because it sounds a little bit, um, I suppose it, it's drudgy in places, but if you really learn to um, articulate your cello bows and keep this lovely steady time, but um, create a sort of choral effect with your with your strings and your bow touch, it can actually be quite beautiful. It's a bit hypnotic. Now I've put it with a drum track. The two reasons. One, I, lo I love the idea of recycling old traditional music and you know, putting a bit of a contemporary edge on them. But more to the point, this keeps your time exact. And you know, you can play around when you know it with um, the, the tempo and the, uh, the pulse. But uh, take this pulse on board and keep it as your own. Keep it internally. Play it over and over again and play along to it. And when you've got this internal pulse, you'll find that you just naturally play the fast bits better. OK, and I love it. It's fantastic. Enjoy it. Play it over and over again. Then start to join in, start to add your instrument. And if you struggle with the um, the quavers, the fast notes, just play the, the first section over the second section. Do you see? I mean, it's a round, basically. So you can do that. It's been written as a round many times by many arrangers. So you don't have to play the exact notes. It's very easy to keep in key. It's, it's basically the scale and the arpeggio. So there are lots of reasons why this is really super to practice your D major um, chord structures on and your broken chords and your arpeggios and your scale. In fact, guys, you can play this and you can just uh, use it as scale practice. It's superb for that. You know, pop the headphones on, pop it in one ear and away you go. It's great fun. OK, so enjoy. And um, I'll be I'll be going through this in more detail, um, you know, with the actual cello. So uh, do enjoy it. I think it's superb.